Okay, hello YouTube, welcome to the silver guide on Haven. Okay, this arrow is for defense, uh, uh, mid, mid doors. Tell your teammates to shoot the doors beforehand. I learned this from Nick Hu. Uh, I adjusted the arrow and made it my own. You go here until you can't see this part of the wood anymore. Look up. You see the triangles above uh, left click, above E, the wall hack icon. And above the wall hack icon, there's a left click icon. And above the left click icon, there's a faint triangle. The left triangle. Make the triangle touch the middle right here. Make it just touch. Just a little touch, dude. In the middle. Go two shots. Revealing area. You will see the people out here. There they are. Shoot them in the head. That's right there. It will there see everything from. It will see everything from here. Basically. And down. This is uh, an arrow for C. C long so to check their spawn. C and you check here too. Line yourself up in the middle here with this box. Then you look up and you you line yourself your crosshair up here. With the middle two, with the, this here, under here, go two charge. Revealing area. It's nice for checking. Uh, Found them. Checking in the beginning in pistol rounds, for example. For defense, I also saw Nick who do this. I haven't used it uh, yet myself, but uh, he does a uh, two bounce here. Revealing area. And it will land up there, and you're safe while doing it, so it's pretty good. But uh, usually I just uh, I just do this because it's all smoked up. Revealing area. Well, usually. This arrow I found today, it's insane. It's a bugged arrow. You'll shoot the arrow down here into the wall. This will get patched, but you can have a lot of fun with it while it's not patched. You go two bounces and w one charge. Revealing area. And you run over here immediately. Get ready found to shoot. Them. And kill them down in short. It will check everything on short. You'll have fun with this. Uh, on A, retake. People usually go for this arrow. Revealing area. It spots pretty much there everything. Or uh, if they're really cheeky, they go for the arrow that goes Revealing area. like that. But that is really hard to hit. It's are. risky. But that check checks literally everything, basically. It, and that's really good. I usually, for retakes, I go up in heaven. I go here and I just throw an arrow here. Area. I've been because I've been thinking Found of them. starting to throw it here Revealing area. because then this arrow there will see it here too but it's always smoked up heaven so it's easy to throw it here Revealing I've also area. been thinking of, of trying to get the arrow Found here them. somehow Revealing area. that arrow is best Found them. for coming out of heaven check under under heaven check over there it won't check long and short but if you come out of heaven, I think this is the arrow you should be, be using. Revealing it's area. easy. But defense on A, you can do two arrows. Go to the sand here. Look at the light bulb here. You do two charges. Revealing area. You will go here and check the T spawn. But there's a better one you should use. You go here in the middle here. And this is even the blue gate starts like here. So you can even stand here. You look up, you take. You see the diamonds. You take the diamonds and you make it touch here. Just touch. A little touch, dude. And you go to charge. Revealing area. It will land in the tree. There they and are. it's literally insane. This arrow is insane. I, I always use this from now on. Another arrow that's bugged that's probably going to get fixed. I don't know the lineup for it, but you can probably find the lineup yourself. <coughs> I'll just show you real quick right here. what it does. Uh, was it two charge? Revealing area. Yeah. And it goes under the map. Found this them. arrow goes under the map. So it lands down here under the map. And it will see everything. So and people can shoot it, it's blocked. You just have to bounce bounce the um, the arrow off of this this building. You can do shock darts like this. Shock dart. Go through the door, pretty good. Two shot darts like this. I never really use these, honestly. Because I think there's better ways to use your shock darts and you usually spam those walls. 
Okay, a nice uh, shock dart on uh, on defense for retake. If they're planning on default, you go one bounce and you just jump and you go shock one. Dart. And it goes, uh, it lands on default. Bam. Pretty good uh, shock dart. Shock dart. This one is easy. Go in the corner here. You see the, the, the start of the tip of the storm arrow. Line up with this thing. Like that thing. I don't know how to explain it right. But make make it touch. Make it touch. And just go. Shock dart. Shock dart. Easy. Easy to do. It, for retake all their planting. You go, you go, bam. There's even a lot of room for error. You can even, you can even miss. It's just a real quick. Just a real quick, man. Okay. The reason why this arrow is so good right here is because... Area. You can be ready to shoot the enemy in the head when it lands through the wall. And the same with this arrow. I saw I saw from the, I saw this from Nick Who's stream. He he would go up here, arrow here, Revealing and then he area. would be ready to shoot anyone that rotate us because there's often rotate us here through the wall. People don't use these arrows enough. Revealing area. And I think this will become a meta for sure with Sova, especially in ranked. It's area. good arrows for yourself, where you can shoot through the wall. I do this, do this a lot on bind, actually. I go showers. And I wall hack for myself on bind. Revealing area. I shoot them through the wall, dude. It's fucking, it's so broken. Well, that was it for defense, I think. Okay, anyways, attack arrows. Attack arrows. All right, here's an arrow. You just li you go in the corner here for C. One sec. You line up your crosshair. Uh, so this, this leaf here is in the middle of the crosshair. Go to charge. Revealing area. This arrow will see everything on C, except here or here. But if if they stand there, they are idiots, and you will easy kill them. It lands there. Really, really, really good arrow. You guys need to know that lineups are not that important. People don't use lineups all the time. It's all in the moment, and you know, you just need to know where it's good to hit the arrow. So for example here, there's usually a smoke here and you're sneaking up with your team. So you you, you wall Revealing backside, you know this is a good place to wall. Found them. And then you go. It's uh, lineups are kind of overrated. Like they're good, but uh, it's all in the moment. You just need to know where it's good to shoot the wall. You don't always need to do lineups because you need to be close to the action when you do it most of the time. And these arrows are not bad because it's, it, just make sure that the arrows are high up in the air. Revealing so area. all the Found CSGO them. players that only can look left and right, they will look, uh, they, they, will, they have to look up Revealing as high as possible. Area. That's gonna be hard for them while you're rushing them too. Also a good strat is um, if there's a smoke here, you can do this everywhere, dude. You drone for your teammate, you go in, again, looking down, going sneaking, sneaking, you know, being a rat. Taking space. The enemy team will uh, try to hide from the drone. Like if they hear the drone, they're, they're trying to hide, right? And if they're not hiding, then you know where they are. And if you clear corners Deploying like this with drone. the drone, and your, te your teammate knows it's clear, he can sneak out. He can start sneaking. Sneak, 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 deep, sneak, dude. You can... Like, you, uh, you can do tons of shit. Okay, arrows on mid. Uh, this is a decent one. Three charge. You just sit here and recharge it. Revealing area. And it's there. There they are. It looks if they if they're rushing mid. I don't really use it that much anymore. So uh, it's it's a uh, it's pretty good. Uh, when you come out mid and you want to go double doors, this is a really good one. You go in here, try to get as close to uh, uh, to the hair as possible. Make it a, make it a little bit risky, because uh, if you do that, revealing area. It lands Found on them. this, and if it lands on this, then it can see here. You can see here. You can see everything in 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 window, no, in garage, except like if they sit here and stuff. But you can smoke this off. You can take garage really easily with that arrow. This is a simple one, but again, Sova is a lot more simpler than you think. It's uh, you just need to know where it's where it's good to shoot the arrows and when it's good to shoot the arrows. It's not all about lineups. I want to give you this example because you can use this a lot of places. If they're smoking mid, they're usually maybe going down mid, you know. 
so you won't hack out. You just stand in the smoke and you just kill them, dude. And yes, this works in high elo. It works in tournaments. It, dude, this will work everywhere. Okay, for mid, it's good to shoot arrows here. Revealing area. On this uh, corner thing, because it will check. It will check down here. It will check down here. It won't check there, but... For example, if you smoke left side here and you ball here, Revealing you, area. you can sneak in. There they are. Because uh, you know that there's no one on the right side. Well, they can be here. Let me smoke that too. So lineups for that would be you go here, you line uh, this thing here, line this that thing here, half half of that that thing, that metal thing. Boom, you go one uh, charge, and you go half again, you know from this distance. There's one bounce, full charge. Revealing area. It will land there. So you there can stand here. You can do the same. You line half again, I think here. Revealing area. Yeah, yeah, and it, it will land over there. So that's Found two uh, kind of safe spots. It's half up. It's just your crosshair. Easy. Revealing area. That's easy for mid. You, you can also wall hack mid uh, if you want, like this. Right here. Not really line up, but just go here in the middle. Look up. Just do one charge. Revealing area. It'll go. It'll go in the middle. And check middle. You can make that better, but this one is really easy. For a long. This one is uh, really good. I always use this and people always get confused by this. You stand here. You line up the lamp and this middle wooden thing. When they are lined up, that's when you're in the right spot like that. Then you aim in the middle of these two and a little bit to the to the right. You do two charge. Revealing area. Boom. Found this them. one is so good, dude. The enemy the enemy team is always like this. They get confused because they're zooming with AVP. So you will always, you will basically always know if someone is there. Area. And if if they if they shoot it, you know they're there too. There they are. Hands up there. Uh, there. Ideally, right there. With this arrow, basically does so they can't use AVP on A long. On A attack, I have this arrow. You line yourself up in the middle with this half and half with the crosshair. Then you look up. You line your left diamond up with this wooden area before the shadow kicks in. Like this right here. You make it touch before the shadow kicks in. Then you line your crosshair up half and half with the shadow and the not shadow. Then you jump and at the highest jump, you do it. Revealing area. Boom. Three charge. There they are. That will scan everything except here. And down shot under heaven and heaven but usually you smoke heaven you smoke ct so the only places you would have to worry about if this does not scan anyone is under heaven or short that is the only places or if they rush through the smoke so if this arrow up here does not scan anyone you can tell your teammates or you will know that they can only be under heaven or here or down shot this is why it is fucking insane. This is why Suba is also insane. It's not only about finding the enemy, but it's also wall hack, not wall hacking them, you know? Because if you don't wall hack them, you know where they will be otherwise. If you know that about all your arrows, then you will become fucking, your brain will become, um, it will explode, explode of knowledge. Also, there's, there's an arrow here I saw from Niku. If, you, if you're like rushing A, if you're coming here and your teammates is down there and they need an arrow fast, you can, you can go here and shoot this roof with full charge and one bounce. Revealing area. That will scan uh, like pretty much Found everything them. on A too. Oh yeah, as I said before, it doesn't have to be hard, you know, to play Sova. You don't have to do lineups all the time, dude. Just know where you want the arrows to hit and it, where they're good, you know? So if you hit here, try, hit it, hit it as high as you can, Revealing area. and that's a good, good place to hit, there dude. They are. And you can just go here. Like if there's a smoke here, you know, you go, you go up, and you just, you just Revealing wall hack it. Area. And then you can be fast and help your team there too. They are. And with that, with that wall hack arrow, it's the same. They can only be under heaven, heaven, CT, but you smoke that, so under heaven or short. Can they be here actually? Found them. I think it'll be here. 
but no one is here, dude. Okay, this this spot is insane. Ulti spot. If you if you play Sova, uh, on uh, yeah, you do because you're watching the video. Stand here. I am the hunter. Go here on A. Go here on A. Ping, ping, on mid window. On my way. And ping on mid. On my way. Line the two pings up. On my way. On and my you way. know, in this map, the enemy T's, the T's, the terrorists, the the attackers, they are always in mid window or mid, trying to get control. So line the two on pings up way. while standing here way. and just I alt the at the beginning of the round and go. And don't miss like me. Just do it in the beginning of the round. You will always get killed. Nearly. Oh, by the way, here's a drone trick. Here's an advanced uh, drone trick. Okay, you stand. You stand here. What you want to do with the drone? You, you go like, the, you drone out. If you know he's there, or he, uh, if he knows you're here and you know he's there and it's like a standoff duel, you do like, you, you drone out, you attack him fast, you, dr you stop the drone, and then you have ball hack. So you, you drone out, go fast, attack him, cancel the drone, and now you have ball hack. You can do this a lot of places, like here too, for example. If the, if it's higher, you just Deploying hold space, drone. boom, stop it, and go. And the way you ult with the with the with, like the best way to ult with Sova is to drone, drone, hit him, ult, and go. Hitting him with the drone is the best way to ult with Sova. Well, if you're droning, it's good Take to learn flight. how to go up and down the drone because you, you can juke people with the drone if you go up and down. Like this. And it's good to be low. I feel like it's good to be low. Low on the ground. It, it, make, it makes it harder to shoot. Like, if you're just Take in the middle flight. here, up top, I feel like it's easier to shoot than if you're on the, on the ground. And also, you need to, with your drone, you have to imagine that you you are yourself, kind of, with the drone, you know? Playing drone. You go You go in with the drone, you go here, you take a quick peek, you peek, you peek right, okay, there's no one, you peek, you peek left. You know, don't die with the drone. Try not to die with the drone and get so much uh, information you can. Also, it's really important with the drone, when you use it, you stand in a kind of safe space so you can't get wall banged, but you, you, you go in, you see him, yo, oh, oh, he, he rushes you because he sees, he sees you're droning, like he's trying to outplay you. But you press C and you stop droning and then you kill him with the, with the wall hex. You have to stop the drone. When you see people rushing you like this, you have to instantly press C and stop the drone. Take Otherwise, flight. he will kill you. You, you. They are. You, yeah, like this. You have to instantly stop it. Also, it's, it goes the same with alt. You alt. Now he knows you're ulting. And you see him rush. You press X and you stop it. It's really important to know too. You have to stop it. Stop the alt if he's rushing you. Otherwise, you're gonna you're gonna die, dude. Okay, last tip for with the drone. A good one for garage is you you drone, drone. and then your teammate follows the drone. You clear corners for him, and he he follows the drone. He's sneaking. Now now he can he can go up here and camp up there. Now he has that position. This is insane. This is why the drone is so good too. Often often with uh, I see I see a lot of sovas where they will go in a in a round, and when there's like 30 seconds left. They will use their Sova arrow just to check long or something. Revealing area. But in my opinion, you should not like in you should you should try to save your arrow when there's low time left for retakes. If there's only 30 seconds left and then they're gonna go somewhere and in my opinion you should save the arrow if you have it at 30 seconds or something for retakes a lot of people just use this arrow on cooldown revealing area and try to get information all the time everywhere but saving the arrow for retakes is really important guys i'll give you two insane arrows on bind okay i'll tell you guys uh okay guys you see the uh 